Fox News senior meteorologist Janice Dean has revealed that Roger Ailes sexually harassed and propositioned her. In the book titled Mostly Sunny, Dean recalls her first meeting with Ailes, writing, He told me I was very funny and good TV. He liked that I had a naughty side. Was I like that in real life? Her next meeting with Ailes before she had been offered the job was at the Renaissance Times Square Hotel, which she thought was a strange meeting place. She wrote of the meeting, After our wine was brought to the table, he reached over and grabbed my hand and held it like a date. He was still holding my hand awkwardly across the table and asked if I had thought about him after our last meeting. Dean says she left bewildered, but things got worse when Ailes called to offer her a job and asked her, so how are you at phone sex? You're a little naughty, I see that side of you. You've played phone sex with your boyfriends before, right? Let me hear what you'd say to him, like if I was your boyfriend. And while she says Ailes never touched her, Dean wrote, he definitely did cross the line. And now we know he did some awful things to some of the women employees, many of whom will never tell their stories because because of non-disclosure agreements. But Mr. Ailes had another side to him. He could be kind and helpful. A Fox News spokesperson provided a statement to The Hollywood Reporter that read, in part, Since Roger Ailes' near immediate removal from the network following an external investigation by an outside law firm, Fox News has undergone a massive reorganization and cultural shift towards an open and transparent environment. We operate under a zero-tolerance policy for sexual harassment and unlawful harassment of any form, which has been strictly enforced. For more revelations from Janice Dean's new book, head to th.com. Until next time, for The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Tiffany Taylor.